Hey there, my name is Desmond, and in this video, I wanna talk with you about the importance of speed when launching a new company. Normally, a person or group decides to create a new business based on an opportunity or a void that they see in the marketplace. For some of us, this period of time can be incredibly exciting, and for others, it can be quite scary. In certain parts of the world, new business owners are a bit more conservative, taking a slower, more calculated approach to launch. Others seem to move at what would be considered lightning speed to seize the opportunities ahead. So the big question is this, what is the best approach? Well, like most other activities in life, both paths have their pros and cons. But what's not commonly discussed when launching a new company is the hidden cost of moving too slowly. You see, when executing a launch process, there are many different people groups involved, especially in the beginning, even if you're self-employed or the sole business owner. And what do we know about people's behavior when things take too long? They lose interest, hope, and in some cases, enthusiasm. So what does an entrepreneur do to accelerate their launch timeline while still making sure all bases are covered? To be honest, it's incredibly hard to do, but it can be done. This is exactly why I've created Launch Plan, a speed optimized task checklist to help you launch any company in record time. The system requires four steps to work successfully. These steps include reverse planning, business functions, critical tasks, and task inputs. Reverse planning forces us to think differently about time. Instead of living in the present, we must live in the future because that's actually where the launch of our new company also lives. You see, working backwards from the goal to the present helps us to uncover hidden tasks and events that we must get done to launch our companies that we otherwise wouldn't know to do. Now, business functions by definition are just a group of related processes. Some common examples of this would be finance, accounting, sales, or even logistics. Now, business functions are important to launch plan because it helps us to easily capture all related tasks in an easy to understand way. Now, on the other hand, critical tasks encourages us to stay laser focused on the minimum number of tasks needed to not only achieve our ideal launch outcome, but also to maximize our speed. The final part of the system is task inputs. A task is simply a piece of work needing to get done. But the big question is, what is a task itself made of? We found that there's actually five different inputs, including materials, people, systems, tools, and organizations that actually make up a task. You see, when launch plan is applied, it's incredibly powerful for entrepreneurs because not only does it allow us to launch in record time, but it helps us to be thorough and also move very, very safely. So that's launch plan, a speed optimized task list to launch any company, anywhere, anytime. I'm super excited to share this tool with you and I'm really looking forward to see the results that it produces. My name is Desmond, creator of Launch Plan, and until next time, much success and luck on your next company launch.